Hello, people on the internet. A long time ago, I made a tutorial how to install Windows 98 on a virtual PC. And even today, that video is still up. And if you follow my steps, it will work. But uh, a few days ago, I had to, op to respond to a comment on that video, and I had to open it. And when I heard my voice, and I and I watched the video a little. I was like, nope, ain't gonna work anymore. That's, yeah, I mean, I, a long time ago. I, I, the audio on half of that video is almost muted because of copyright. And it really grinds my ears. So without any further ado, I'm gonna make a new Windows 98 tutorial. I will be demonstrating this in VM Workstation, although this should, the setup process is pretty much the same in, in, in virtual PC, virtual box, VMware, whatever. Uh, so yeah, let's do this. So the first thing you need is your Windows 98 ISO, link in the description. And whatever you are using Windows, uh, Virtual PC, VMware, VirtualBox, whatever. Once you have set up your virtual machine, setting up different machines is different. Wait, what? Now you have to start your virtual machine, so power on this virtual machine. It will take some time to power on. And I have previously... Uh, I have previously mounted... No... Damn it. Okay, so first of all you have to boot from CD. Uh, boot from CD-ROM. Start Windows 95 set up from CD-ROM. While it's installing, I do want to mention a few things. Number one, I've been, oh, we look at this, hit enter, configure un unlocated disk space. Yes, enable our disk support, and it'll reboot, and just do the same thing again. Boot from CD ROM, from CD ROM. Um, I have been inactive a lot on my site and on my channel reason being because school kicked in yo and yeah i had a lot i had still have a lot of homework i still have a lot of study you will get this at enter i still have a lot of stuff to do regarding school but so winter holidays are near and i i have a lot of projects in the works I uh, have a one, one uh, techno mix in the work. Uh, another video I won't mention. It's it's halfway there, but this video is somewhat to continue. It's somewhat is something somewhat of a priority because the old video was just bad. Man, I, I was very team when I made this video. Let's see for that video. I'm almost seventeen. Dang it! Coffee, coffee. Um, on other, some other things I want to mention, I have 172 subscribers. It's cool that I said next, which is fun for me. A lot. 170 people like my content, and one more. Well, I know these types of video, my two mixes I made, three games, I well, a list of three games I made. Your truck simulator videos, maybe? Yeah. Uh, you will get this. Choose whichever you want. I will go custom. Just because I can. And because I'm a system administrator. <laughs> next. Uh, yes, select desktop teams. An enormous 31 megabytes. Um, yeah. Next. <coughs> I'm a bit quiet. Computer name. Uh, PC. Workgroup. Workgroup. Computer description. Uh, next. You can select your uh, keyboard and regional. Keyboard layout and original settings here, and you can keep it followed. 
Establishing your location. If you like, you can set your location. There we go. Good old Bosnia Herzegovina. After a while, the uh, file copy will finish and we'll get this priest after your virtual machine. Getting ready to run Windows for the first time. Here you will type in your name and I have an idea. Widget. I accept, of course, yet next product key. And gone. Once you have entered your product key, product key the uh, setup process is pretty much there. Most of the stuff that's remaining is automated, so you won't have to do much. Of course, you'll have to restart yet again. Windows is shutting down. Oh yeah, one thing to mention, if it gives you the option to move from CD or hard drive, make sure to select hard drive. If you select from CD, you will have to do with the whole thing. Now it's just the usual, so that you have to select the time zone. And boom! There you have it. Oh damn let me oh god do we do it have to do do this I have to do this damn it I am just gonna let it do this thing so that's pretty much it thank you guys so much for watching this video I hope that you found it useful um I hope it worked if you have any problems drop them in the comments below and I will try to answer your questions, problems, and stuff. Um, that's pretty much it. One thing to mention: if you are a Portal fan, go ahead and follow me on Instagram. It's at cave.johnson.aperture.co. I am the Aperture's 
we will see you all future. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe, and I will be seeing ya. Peace.